Now for our dress number one news team, at this time, please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. Attention, salute, pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Now for Charlie Harris. Today's weather brings a 56% chance of rain with a high 72 and a low of 58. Tomorrow continues to be rainy with, with the chance of precipitation being 70%. Don't forget to bring an umbrella or a raincoat. Middle schoolers, have you bought your ticket for the dance? The dance is tomorrow, February 17th from 3 to 5 p.m. The theme of the dance is neon and the cost of ticket is $5 and you can pay online to my school books. Anyone who wants to order a yearbook may do so until February 28th. Middle schoolers, have you been considering your class choices for the next school year? The largest curriculum night is tonight. There will also be a curriculum night for a rising ninth graders at Bowden from 6 to 7. TCBY is in the middle school cafeteria today. There will be a 5th and 6th grade lunch in line with the dental hygiene tips tomorrow. Here's lunch meals, oven roasted chicken, meatloaf, whole grain roll, mashed potatoes, and glazed carrots. Lily Wright has today's sports news. What do you have for us, Lily? I'm Lily Wright and I'm here with Claire Shaw. What do you do in Girls in the Run? We talk a lot about other people's feelings and how to connect with their teammates and encourage each other, and we also run. Okay, thank you. And I'm here with Kendall Barton. What do you like about Girls on the Run? And we do like activities to connect with each other and we do like play like, star power and how to get activated. Okay, thank you. Sports reporter Wyatt Warren has today's Trivia Thursday. Trivia Thursday. Today's trivia question is what MLB pitcher has done the fastest pitch of all time? And now for Black History Month. Ruby Nell Burgess Hall is an American civil rights activist. She was the first African American child to desegregate the William Pratt Elementary School in Louisiana during the New Orleans desegregation crisis on November 14, 1960. Eco Guardians and the Energy Bus were here for elementary students yesterday. We had reporters there. Let's check it out. Situation on our hands. Thursday. Our reporters spoke with several sisters students about what they're thankful for. Let's hear from reporter Stella Todd and Alvin Polk. I'm Stella Todd and I'm here with Kayla Eisenheimer. What are you thankful for today? I'm thankful for my friends and my family and teachers here at Red Arc Building um, for teaching us my skills and just trying to help us be successful in life. Okay, thank you. I'm Stella Todd and I'm here with Olivia McCauley. What are you thankful for? I'm just thankful for my friends, my family, and just for everything the school has done. Also, just learning new techniques in life from my friends, such as like art and new skills for my grandma, like food. Okay, thank you. The answer of today's trivia question is Nolan Ryan at 108 miles per hour. Thanks for watching the RJS News Show. Are you ready for the dates? Yes, I just want to join already. Yes, I'm happy. Yes. Yeah, so important.